Hi, my beauties. I'm so happy. It's new moon and I'm going to channel Lilith today. Lilith, who announced herself already some days ago. And I understand more and more her importance for our new world. And I'm so happy that I can channel her today. And I connected already um, to her in this morning meditation that I made, that I do every day, every morning. And I felt her power and her force, which is very intuitive and instinctive force. It's the feminine. It's the ultimate feminine, the true feminine force. But what I felt as well is a demonic, demonic force, Di uh, demon, demon, demons, a force of demons, an evil force. And I asked her why and she just want, wants to destroy. She wants to destroy. That's what demons are made for, <laughs> to destroy. And normally I, I don't channel demons and I don't, I'm not for destroying with force and evil. I'm for a change of this world um, through living love and compassion and unity. But she wants to destroy this old constructs that there are. This old constructs where women are less worthy than men. And this in every one of us, in men and women. So it's not a, a gender story. Um, we find this feminine and masculine in each one of us. And she wants us to give this feminine energy free, our intuition, our instincts. She wants that this feminine energy has the same importance in our life as this masculine energy. And that's why she wants to destroy. She wants to destroy and she's powerful. She wants to destroy old constructs in which this is not given, this balance, this equally um, between or of our two parts, our feminine and our masculine. Yes, and I, I feel as well that I asked then for her core, for what she came for here. And this is just instinct and this pure feminine power, this what is not um, uh, mind, but very instinctive and very like a deep, dark mud, <laughs> but at the same time very powerful. <sighs> An instinctive intuitive power and I think this demon parts of her are there because she was she's an energy out there and we feed it her for millions uh, thousands of years with this demon uh, attributes for thousands of years, she she was called a demon, and that's how she became. Her energy became demon. But in in because.
because we demonized or the church demonized her feminine energy. Which is the door to everything, to the world behind these curtains. She's the door to this world behind the curtains and to our power, infinite power. And that's why she was demonized. And we made a demon of her and that's her energy now. And it is very <sighs> enraged <laughs> and because it wants to destroy this construct. It doesn't want to be closed. It doesn't want to be suppressed anymore. Yes. And I'm going to channel her in a church, in an old church. And I, yeah, I'm looking forward to see what happens, what will happen. And I think she's so important for our time now to, yeah. I already told you why, because she, her energy is the door behind these curtains and into our infinite power and into our infinite words and dimensions that we are. Thank you. <laughs>